guess who's back? Back again. Jewel just back. Tell a friend. For a little bit, I already tried to get you guys to, to vote for this year, but now I'm just going to do it myself. We have the World Box Napoleonic War. Let's hype it up for all the World Box fans. So the way I try to do this is just add a lot of different nations. But for example, for Russia, I don't want this just like a tiny, big, huge Russia. I just added a lot of Russias and I hope that one Russia cannibalizes the other Russia. For example, so Ottomans had a bit of a vaster territory, so I also made them take that one. As well as I added two Prussias just to make them a little more powerful. Yeah, France already annexed the Federation of the Rhine while I did this, which isn't too bad since they were puppet in real life. And yeah, I tried to balance it out by power a bit, so Russia would be stronger because they have like seven different Russias. There's a good chance they'll cannibalize each other and they will have one mega Russia. Same goes obviously for France here down, that's also another France. And I couldn't add Portugal because Spain it just didn't leave any room for Portugal. So, before we get into this video though, really, I am going to urge you to become a member. Click this little box, it will pop up on your top right and it will show you what for advantages you get if you become a member. It would really do with the channel well if you become a member. You get some emojis and I will give you a lot of love and appreciation. And for everybody else, if you just are watching this and are subscribed, why aren't you subscribed? Do it for, for the free-headed dog, Tartaros. For reasons I don't know. So let's get this party started. So immediately, Italy annexes Switzerland. Thank you, for <laughs> Italy, for that. I added Sardinia Piedmont, by the way, as well. The Prussia annexes Denmark. This Prussia, oh my god, I might have made Prussia a little bit too powerful. This Prussia here. Uy, uy, uy. Let's balance it out by giving France a bit more population. Um, by the way, here another nation spawn, which I'm going to make Austria. Just because, before we really start this video, give you predictions. Everybody who is annexed now still has a chance. They still have a chance. Oh my god, another Russia popped up. Another, enough Russias now. Tons of Russias. Oh my god, there's like a Finnish Russia as well. Russia here. And again, a Russia here. Tons of Russias. Now, I hope this, these are all the nations which will spot <laughs> even more Russias. Russia, Russia, Russia. I love how there's just a bajillion Russias, but I couldn't add Portugal. Russia, the white Russia in Russia, annexed the other Russia. <laughs> Too many Russias right now. You have to just name them by color. I think Prussia and the first Prussia, France and the first Prussia are having a bit of war, as well as second France and Italy. It, it will clear up a little bit. Do you know what I'm going to I'm going do some war crimes and kill off some Prussian boys since the settlement is just too powerful. I gave it too much population. War crimes and it's down to 30 population. This seems fine to me. War crimes. But this Prussia already annexed Warsaw and this part of Russia. Ugh, another Russia popped up. Russia it off. Freaking Austrian Empire annexed the Ottoman Empire which is very interesting. I like how the UK is already settling Ireland. France already super powerful. France already annexed all of um, Italy. Let's have a quick look at the alliance map mode. Who is France? France hates the UK. That is very historically accurate. This Russia wants to unite Russia. This Prussia hates Russia and Sweden. Okay. Spain hates this France. No, everybody hates Spain actually. Everybody hates Spain. Just screw Spain, I guess. Look at this France already super powerful. That's exactly what I had intended. Napoleon marching. Marching on Italy first. This is so freaking historically accurate. I love it. The Ottomans are already annexing parts of the Russians. Interesting. Prussians still going quite powerful as well as the... Oh, both Prussians. So Prussia annexed Austria, so the Ottomans are uh, independent again. Interesting. Britain annexed a part of France, so France is a bit to do with uh, the UK and Prussia. Ooh, Spain was annexed by France, so France already owning all of uh, Iberia and Italy. And the UK! Oh my god. France annexed the UK. What they did manage to do in the real life, they managed to engage super fast. France is scary. Right now, the most powerful nation seems to be Prussia, the yellow, bluish one. Second is our France, because they seem to struggle with a lot of wars. Let's check it out. Who is France at war with? Yeah, they have a lot of wars. They have to focus. One nation after each other. Probably should go for the second France. First unite France. <laughs> Deal with the, 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 the monarchists. Take out the monarchist French. The Danes are independent now. Owning Austria. Interesting. Very interesting. Prussia going ham. Okay, France annexing the second France. I only have to annex Spain. 
and they're cornered off, which will make them super powerful. But our little Prussian boys also look quite powerful. So Napoleon, where are you going to conquer? You own Switzerland, you own France, you own Italy, you own, you own the UK. Take out the Spanish. Who are, who are you at war with? Let's check it out. Oops, no. Who are you at war with? With all your neighbors. Brilliant, Napoleon. That's a strategic brilliancy. Sardinia, Piedmont, still independent. Oh, Spain was annexed by France. Let's look if they can keep it that way or if there's going to be constant revolts like in real life. The Ottomans now own the Austrians, so the Ottomans are seem to be a bit more consolidating slowly. They actually took Vienna, which is a first. Russia still struggling to unite. I am really scared for Russia. I just like how freaking the Ottoman Empire controls Brittany. Why? <laughs> just why? <laughs> France, you want to maybe take this back? This is a bit ridiculous. Denmark somehow growing in power. Oh! Taking out the Federation of the Rhine. Meanwhile, the Ottomans slowly getting control over all the Balkans. And Russia still not uniting. Look at Russia. They would have to unite this part and then go southern. But this Russia might do good as well. I mean, just... Yeah, a lot of Russias is the more the merrier. Okay, Prussia went after Denmark instead of France. And France finally took back Brittany for reasons which are obvious. So right now we have like three mega powers. We have the Ottomans, we have the French, and we have the Prussians. Who now lost their capital and now they actually are freaking Poles. The Duchy of Warsaw is not a capital, so I guess the Prussians are Poles. Okay, it's back, but the Duchy of Warsaw is still the capital. I guess Poland owns it now, technically. <laughs> now hoping the Red Ottoman Empire takes out the White Ottoman Empire, then we'd have one very, very solid power. But the Red Ottoman Empire is struggling right now to fight against the mega Prussians. While France is taking out Sardinia Piedmont and really keeping Western Europe and North Africa, they're still struggling to get. Yeah, if they get that, they are very, very, very scary. There's a huge invasion force going after this African tribal... It's a tribal union. <laughs> Fight tribals, but you, you will, you'll eventually fail, obviously. I'll leave them at their tribal names. Oh, and they're French now. Okay, so France is fully cornered off, which makes France scary. Prussians are taking out parts of Russia now. Yeah, the Central Empire is very, it's probably the most powerful right now. No, France is stronger. France is stronger. Yeah, now France is going after the Duchy of Warsaw, but let's say the, the Prussians. Uh, that means Napoleon will soon extend his power even further. So Russia and France are working together right now to kill off the Central Europeans. Sounds like World War One. We're Napoleonic times, so things are different. Yeah. Oh, oh my god, the Prussians are at war with the world. Seems a bit sketchy. Just a little bit sketchy. Yeah, just look at Prussia, they're getting demolished. Yep. France owns all of Western Europe. Is it time for a Russian nerf? Now they're going after Sweden, and the Russians are... They, they need to consolidate right now. I hope really white, the white Russia goes after... This Russia goes after the other... They seem to be too friendly, that's the issue. They have to unite their power. The Ottoman Empire, the two Ottoman Empires, also isn't working out for the best right now. Just leaves a lot of room for France to destroy everybody. Sweden has been taken out as well from the French. The French right now seem unstoppable. So who is France going after right now? France is going after nobody, they're peaceful. Russia is peaceful. I think the Ottomans are probably warring each other, yes. And this Russia is also peaceful. Why is everybody so peaceful? Come on, Russia. Take out Russia too. Oh, there is war with France. That's too early for them. That's too early. That is far too early. France is absolutely going to demolish Russia right now. But oh, the Russians are getting... The white Russians are having trouble. They're fighting now with the other Russians. That's far too late. Far too late. Except if they do like a super fast annex. The white Russia has to really annex the other Russia super fast. They took up back to Dutch of Warsaw so in the meantime. Okay, one part of Russia has gone. Come on, come on, come on, white Russia. Okay, Russia took out the northern part of the other Russia. Let's see if they can take out the rest. Now, the Duchy of Warsaw seems to be the independent one. Again, Warsaw is coming back as the capital for reasons unknown to man. Ooh, Russia! Come on, Russia, you have to take out the other Russia very, very fast. They, ca they can't win a civil war and beat the French. That's just too much. But I like how they united. Russia looks semi... Looks like they almost could compete. Europe honestly looks right now like it did before the French decided to go into Russia apart... Yeah, yeah, no, no, not anymore. 
Nope, nope, nope. France here to demolish, to ruin our lives. Be Turn the world French. Napoleon and his 500,000 Grand Armée is here. Yes, and there's, it's not winter yet. Moscow is still alive right now for a matter of seconds. Moscow is alive and they are gone. France is insane. Now they only still have to take out the Poles, their allies and the Ottomans eventually. Try to go after Egypt and actually succeed this time. Well, now the Dutch of Warsaw also is fighting against France, so at least they're fighting two fronts at once. Though they should be powerful enough easily to take out both. The Swiss rebelled! My people are rebelling! The Ottoman Empire consolidated! Go Switzerland! Do it! <laughs> Become the one star! The one piece! This is the dent in the freaking French armor! Do it! Come on Switzerland! They're, they're going to die so hard. But it might give the rest of the army some time. Yeah, no, Switzerland's gone. <laughs> oh, and so is the Balkans. I like how Ireland is still independent. Oh, yeah, yeah, the world is turning green ASAP. So officially, yeah, it's Russia, uh, France versus the Ottomans. Rest in peace, Ottoman Empire. I'm just going to watch it get destroyed. They're trying to get these cities here, but yeah, the, 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 the armies are slowly arriving back from Ireland. Which means it's going to be over very soon. Very soon. Russia was annexed. Ottoman Empire. I mean, Turkey is annexed. Now only still the Caucasus region is holding out. And it's getting destroyed. Only still one single man standing against the whole of Europe. What will this man do? Where is he? I don't even see him. Where is he? Here. Here we have him. The last. It's even a woman. The last proud Russian woman. She died. <laughs> So there we have it, Worldbox decides France is the ruler of Europe. I hope you enjoyed this, if you want more Worldbox videos, obviously like this video, subscribe, give me that wonderful watch time, become a member, special shout out to Revolution, hashtag 3299, Ravanian11 and VictorSMG for being the best members out there, I wish you a nice day and bye.